Greetings, beautiful being, and welcome to today's Movement Medicine Morsel. Today we're going to play with a flow from Daisy Lee's Radiant Lotus Women's Qigong, but it's for everybody, and it's called Uniting the Three Hearts. So these flows always have names that denote more than one meaning. So what could be these three hearts? Well, heart, love, we could be uniting the love of body, mind, and spirit together. Those are three energies that are better together than separately. We can be uniting the heart of the earth, the sky, and our most beautiful potential as humans, or anything else that you like. So here we go. We're going to rehearse a little bit the movement of the hands, and then we'll practice it either seated or standing. It's very versatile in that way. I'm going to move back a little bit so you can see a bit more with the hands. <clears throat> so let's just rub our hands a little bit and warm them up. I don't know how it is where you are, but it's very cold where I am. A little extra cold today. So just warming up the hands as though you're washing them with chi, washing them with energy, washing them with love. Okay. So the first movement of the hands, and this is just rehearsing the hands, we're going to be holding the energy. We make a little bowl with the energy. And just breathe smoothly and gently and bring yourself to your vertical alignment, even for our rehearsal. How we do everything, how we do anything is how we do everything. So let's feel our feet, our sit bones grounding us and grow through the roof of the mouth and the crown of the head. Soft smile, gentle breathing. So here we are cupping energy. And now the energy is rising and the backs of the fingers come together. And then around the throat and the face, the palms face in. And as the hands move above the head, we come to prayer position. Now from here, there's a beautiful opening where the elbows move first, and that allows the arms to pour down and the heart to rise and swoon. I'll do all of that from a little bit of a side view. So just breathing comfortably, you can follow along. We're cupping the energy, then the backs of the fingers come together, then the flats of the hands, then the prayer hands above, and the elbows slide to the sides and they pour open and there's a luscious, sumptuous reception in the chest and the throat. So one last time for the rehearsal before we put it all into the actual flow and we'll do it with the breath. So, on the inhalation, we're bringing energy up in the cup. Exhalation, coming up to the heart. Inhalation, over the throat and the face. Exhalation, up to the sky. And now inhale that beautiful ecstatic energy in. Okay, even if you don't have it quite 100%, doesn't matter, we're going to keep building on it. I'm going to move back a little bit and we'll do one or two seated and then the rest will be standing. So we're seated beautifully in our vertical alignment. We feel that connection. We know we're connecting to the bigger energies of love everywhere within ourselves, around us, with each other. So that's enough to put a smile on the face. So we begin by holding a ball of energy low and comfortably. Exhale, soften, feel the earth. Inhale, let the energy come through you and expand, the fingertips rise. Exhale, we fold over, we bow to the earth, and here comes the part we practiced. Inhale, the fingertips come up towards the base of the spine. Exhale, continue the energy up to the heart. Inhale, over the throat and the face. Exhale, reaching up to touch the heavens. And inhale, receiving the bliss. Coming up and exhaling, 
bowing to the earth, inhaling, bringing the cupped hands up to the pelvic region, exhale, continuing the energy up to the heart, inhale, covering the throat and the face and the mind, exhale, rising, connecting to the big energies, and inhale, receiving, being washed and purified. And exhale, bring the hands to rest low. You can continue in the chair. If anybody wants to join me for standing, you can do that. Once again, let's refresh our vertical alignment because that's the basis for everything. We know we're connected to the heart of the earth. We know and we feel that we're connected to the heart of the sky. And this vertical alignment opens up so much more of our potential. It opens up that beautiful channel in the spine. It opens up our posture. It reminds us of all of our resources and our natural beauty and all of our possibilities. And we can't help but smile. Take an inhalation <coughs> and exhale, soften the knees a little bit, bow a bit to the earth. On the inhalation, let the energy expand you, open wide. Exhale, soften and travel to the earth and make your connection. Inhale, the energy starts to rise through the cupped hands. Exhaling, the backs of the fingers travel to the heart. Inhaling, the flats of the hands come over the throat and the face. And exhaling, the whole body rises up to touch the sky. And inhaling, the elbows open and the heart and throat expand. And we begin again. Exhale, connecting to earth. Inhale, bringing that love and energy up to the pelvis. Exhale, continuing it up to be recharged through the heart. Inhale over the throat and the face and the mind and exhale connecting to the heart of the heavens. Inhale, let yourself be bathed with bliss and we'll do one more. Exhale, connecting to the heart of the earth. Inhale, carrying that message up into our physical bodies. Exhaling, continuing to join with our own hearts Inhaling through the throat, the mind, the face. Exhaling, connecting up to the heavens. And inhaling that luscious swoon. And exhaling, softening, bringing the hands to a ball of energy. And now small pulsation. Inhale, we rise and the energy ball opens just comfortably. Exhaling, we soften. Inhaling, we expand and feel the whole of you, all of you. Feel your legs. Maybe if you're sitting, you're even pressing into the ground a little bit with your feet. And one more time, opening. Bring the feet together, standing or sitting, and exhale, embrace the ocean of energy. Fold your hands. I'll come a little closer so you can see that detail and let the hands rest over the heart of your lower dantian, that's a field of elixir. For women, you can think of this as your womb center. And this is the yogic center, the chakra or vortex of energy known as svadhisthana, the abode of oneself. So it's flow, creativity, fertility for all. If you have a womb, it's your womb center. If you don't have a womb, it's still your womb center on a metaphoric level. And let yourself breathe and feel a flow of energy bathing your pelvic center. The belly falls in as you exhale. The belly and the sacrum expand as you inhale. Your heart is shining. Your mind is shining and you know that you're connected to earth, self, and heavens, to body, mind, spirit, and to the energy of love that circulates and unites everything, all of it.
and know that this energy that you feel is yours. You can bring it with you wherever you go after this little mini session. And I thank you so much for joining in to today's Movement Medicine Morsel. Blessings and love. And may you feel that circulation of love always. Bye for now.